Five years after the best-selling Classic Farming with Classic Machinery DVDs were filmed, we're returning to the Saunders family's clay pit farm in Norfolk. A 26,000 hour David Brown 880 Selectomatic was previously used for almost all of the spraying and fertilizer spreading on the farm. But these duties have now been taken over by a 1992 Bateman Hilo 2001. This is our Hilo 2001, uh, bought as a replacement for the David Brown 880 and Ransom's Crop Guard sprayers. Uh, we'd been looking for a Bateman for quite a few years. Um, high in our shop, at least ideally we would like to have got an RB15 or 16, but couldn't find one that was in budget. So we settled on this and it was probably a good compromise for us really, because really, it's a very low weight machine, weighing about four tonnes. It's got a John Deere engine, it's got the slightly more updated cab compared to the early high lows and uh, we just really liked the way the outfit was made and how the boom works. The sprayer was refurbished when it arrived. Its contour boom has been reduced from 24 metres to 20 to fit with the farm's 4 metre drill width. Bateman's original Hilo first appeared in 1985. The updated Hilo 2001 arrived in 1992 with a new cab and a 110 horsepower John Deere engine. It has a 2000 litre capacity tank. The Bateman also does all of the fertiliser spreading. The spray pack is removed and a Vicon Rotaflow spreader on a demountable subframe is fitted.
Anyway, we bought this Bateman high low to uh, do the spraying on the farm, which took over from the 880 and the ransom sprayer. And so, uh, obviously, get over the work a bit quicker and nice and light and uh, 20 meter spray, boom. And so, um, that speeded things up there quite a bit. Anyway, we decided we'd like to do some spreading with it as well, spread some fertilizer. Uh, because I was using 8-8 in a virus spreader, so 12 meter spread on that wasn't wide enough now. So we decided to uh, buy ourselves a unit that goes on the, or a take-off unit that goes on the high low. And um, so we managed to get hold of that, and then we bought this Rotor Flow Viking spreader, uh, second hand off one of the dealers, and um, had to do quite a bit of extensive work to it, as it was a few bits rotted out of it, and one area so uh, yeah, it had to be sort of refurbished pretty well to sort itself out so we could get it to work and uh, anyway now we managed to get the whole thing together now and got it on the bateman as you can see uh, we've had all of the actual unit that goes on so we can pick it up with a pick it up with a forklift now or teleport or whichever so we can lift the whole thing on and off now so we don't have to jack it up anymore because that was quite awkward jacking it up and taking it off but we still have to with a spray but uh, so yeah that's uh, we fit it on here so we know she'll do 20 meter spread and Basically what you like, yeah. All right, nice bit of kit.
Classic farming with classic machinery is available now.